Hello and welcome to The Bike Century. My name's Ben and today it's an another exciting day. It's another new model in stock from CF Moto. This replaces the outgoing CF Moto 450 SR uh, and is replaced by this, the SRS. Um, fundamentally the same bike, um, very similar price point but ever so slightly different spec, uh, some slightly different cosmetics. It's a, a really good model for us. Um, falls within the, the sort of A2 legal super sport class um, and looks absolutely fantastic, as you can see. Uh, sold loads of the SRs. We've been without stock for, for quite some time, so we're really excited to get this bike in. Uh, available in the two colours that you see here. Not sure which one I prefer, to be honest. Um, they both look absolutely stunning. Obviously designed to look like a full-on super sport bike, but there are some subtle differences in terms of riding position, uh, practicality, stuff like that, and I'll get into that. Um, so I guess the first thing to ask yourself is which colour do you prefer? We've obviously got both in stock, and we're just about to register our demonstrator as well. So if you're interested, uh, we will have a bike for you to ride, probably by close of play tomorrow. So what is the SRS? Um, it's a 450cc parallel twin, uh, just under 47 horsepower, uh, A2 legal, so you can ride this on a, uh, on a new A2 license, would compete with things like the CBR 500R, the 450 or so 400 Ninja, that sort of thing. Um, but uh, the engine configuration of this has a 270 degree crank, similar to a uh, cross plane crank on an R1 or an MT07. What does that mean in the real world? Well, to you and I, the mechanics of it will remain a mystery, but effectively uh, a reduced resonance for the engine. So you don't get numb fingers like you would do on a more agricultural parallel twin. Uh, a much smoother throttle pickup and response, uh, slightly more power, and the sound is absolutely yeah. biblical. Uh, these sound amazing. Um, there is a video in the description below which will link you to the SR with a Van Hall exhaust system on it um, and just have a listen to that for the sound. It sounds absolutely amazing. So what do you get with an SRS? Well, you start at the front end. Um, we've got 17 inch lightweight wheels, a massive 320 millimeter Brembo disc and Brembo four pot radially mounted calipers with ABS. Uh, loads and loads of braking power. This bike is super light, so it doesn't need twin discs, just needs the single disc. Um, good tires, upside down forks, uh, a small amount of adjustment, but to be fair, these are set up really well for the road uh, and being such a lightweight bike, you don't want to mess around with it too much. We've got these uh, strobing uh, daytime lights. Uh, these two bikes are brand new. They're not connected up to the batteries. Um, so for the uh, for the lights and the dash and everything, if you just look, look in the description below, there'll be a video of the SR, which has the same uh, lights and the same electronics package. These carbon fiber look winglets are absolutely awesome. Look at the, the aero on this. I've really sort of thought about the design on this bike. Looks absolutely stunning. Um, not sure how much that effect that has on the actual bike itself, but um, but they certainly look the part. They're finished in uh, a two-tone, so this is obviously gloss black and then like a satin finished plastic with this mock carbon fiber. Uh, the alternate colorway uh, is like this, uh, what's the Audi color code uh, that you get, but um, it's like this, almost like this primer gray, which looks really cool and, uh, and the gloss black. And then again, you get the mock carbon. One of the things you get on both bikes is these inbuilt crash protectors. That's a really nice feature. Uh, if you were to drop the bike, it just stops everything from impacting the ground and smashing to bits. Uh, the, the actual parts cost and stuff like that for these bikes is relatively low. Um, one of the big changes on SRS compared to SR is the underbelly exhaust. Uh, well, I believe one of the reasons for this is the new uh, impending Euro 5B emissions, um, but also it has allowed them to open up and have a single sided swing arm put on there. Very Ducati esque. Um, really, really looks cool number of aftermarket exhaust options available for these bikes. Um, I believe the Van Hall systems that we fitted, the under seat systems that we fitted to the previous SR would also fit this, uh, along with the towel tidies and all that sort of stuff. We do the seat cow screens, all the normal accessories that you'd expect for a brand new bike uh, are currently available through KTM. Um, riding position is 
the, the actual seating position is very much super sport, but the actual bar position relative to the um, the seat is quite high. They're not clip-ons, they're above the, uh, the top yoke. So much more comfortable than a traditional sport bike would be. Let's see if I can just show you that now. So if you look at the bar height compared to the seat, uh, this is aimed at someone who, who would want to ride this every day or someone who's relatively new to riding. So it's much friendlier on the wrists than perhaps, you know, like an R6 or something similar. Really great spec uh, on this. So all the brakes, uh, Jejuan parts, Brembo parts, all the switch gear and electronics are produced by um, Bosch. We've got a full color TFT dash there. The bike comes with a tracker, uh, a couple of different display modes, Bluetooth connectivity. And like I said, if you're interested in all that stuff, uh, check out the video that we did of the SR and that will give you a full walkthrough on how the electronics package works. I, I dare say we'll do another video uh, once the uh, the demo is powered up anyway. So yeah, uh, the same as any CF Moto currently, it will come with a four year warranty, uh, parts and labor. Uh, also comes with free breakdown cover and every time you have the bike serviced, uh, subsequent to that, you will get another year free breakdown cover every year that you keep the bike maintained to the manufacturer's standards. So really, really good. Very low rate finance available on these bikes at the moment, which are 5699 on the road. So that includes your years, tax, your first registration fee and the preparation of the bike. They are in stock, so they are available immediately pretty much uh, with the normal sort of prep time, wait time. Um, and like I say, the demo will be available in the next couple of days. So if you're interested in having a go, um, jump on the website, go to the new bike section, book a demo, get yourself booked uh, and get in and have a go on this bike. It's an incredible bit of kit. The engine is by far, in my opinion, uh, the best engine in an A2 legal sport bike. Um, and I'm in a position of knowledge there because we sell R3s, Ninja 400s, CBR 500s, all the normal sort of parallel, parallel twin sport bikes. Um, and this is by far the best all round package that I've ridden uh, in a very long time. So really, really good bikes. I'm gonna leave it there. Make sure you check out the other links to listen to the sound and to look at the dash. Uh, if you're interested in the bikes, you've got any questions, feel free to reach out. We've got WhatsApp, live chat, all the socials. Pick up the phone and ask us any questions that you've got or feel free to drop in and you can see the bikes in the flesh, sit on them and maybe uh, go out on a demo. That's it from me. Thanks for watching. Look forward to speaking to you soon.